Mid-side mixing is a powerful technique that can enhance the quality of your mixes. It works by decoding a stereo signal into two parts, the mid-channel, which contains the information that appears in both the left and right channels, the mono signal, and the side channel, which contains all the information that differs between the left and right channels. Here are the top 5 tips for effective mid-side mixing. Mid-side reverbs. Reverb is an integral part of any music production for adding width and space. When applied to the side channel, it can create a sense of spaciousness without muddying the mid-channel. This can help to maintain clarity in the mix while still achieving a wide stereo image. Arrangement Mid, Side EQ and Compression When mid, side processing, it can be easy to get caught up in enhancing the smaller elements of your mix and ignore the bigger picture. By using EQ and compression on the mid and side channels separately, you can shape the tonal balance and dynamics of your mix in a way that best serves the song. Mixing of main elements. The main elements of your mix, such as the kick, snare, and vocals, are typically placed in the mid-channel for maximum impact. By carefully balancing these elements against the wider elements in the side channel, you can create a mix that is both powerful and wide. Mid, side volume mixing and automation. Volume automation is a powerful tool for creating dynamic interest in your mix. By automating the levels of the mid and side channel separately, you can create moments of width and depth that draw the listener in. Enhanced Sidechain Sidechain compression is a popular technique in many genres of music. By applying sidechain compression to the side channel, you can create a pumping effect that adds rhythm and groove to your mix without affecting the clarity of the elements in the mid-channel. Mid-side mixing is a powerful tool, but it should be used judiciously. Overuse can lead to a mix that sounds unnatural or unbalanced. As with all mixing techniques, the key is to use your ears and make decisions that serve the song. Happy mixing! Please leave a comment with your own tips and what you would like us to cover next. Also tickle that like button and hit the bell and subscribe notification for more no-nonsense tips.